the internet sideways. Hello, everyone. <laughs> it's your host, your friend, your boy, Jet Black, the one and only here with a host, a friend, a boy, Weenslow. And today we are going to be looking at cool stuff on Amazon. We're just going to take turns uh, searching stuff on Amazon and looking at what comes up and seeing what we like. Uh, would you like to go first? Sure. Okay. Uh, what would you like to search on Amazon? We have a little mic, Winslow. You could literally, uh, Winslow. You could just say whatever you want. It's so fast. Diarrhea. So we're gonna search diarrhea and see what comes. Oh, up. it's just the oh. Yeah, that's like disappointing. Relieve diarrhea. Excuse me. Do you think on Amazon someone would be selling just bags of <laughs> yes. gal- get your gallon of diarrhea? I just said diarrhea. Get, get your gallon of gonorrhea. <laughs> Get it while it's hot. <laughs> it's always hot. Freshly served diarrhea. Giant microbes diarrhea. Oh, plush toy. Plush toy. Ooh. Plush diarrhea. Yep. Cool stuff to buy. Plush, time. <laughs> plush diarrhea. I didn't know it was a microbe. I it is a diarrhea of the microbe. It's specifically Canthylobacter jejunine. Jejunine. It's, yeah, a, it's a ninja. I guess that's something that's like in your body. Yeah. It's fucking weird. I didn't know that was a bacteria. Did you know that giant microbes is like a line of plushes? Like, they don't yeah. just have the diarrhea. They have some. They sell them at the, the bookstore. Hmm. Did yeah. you know that? I didn't know I could get diarrhea at the bookstore. That's good to know. I didn't think they sell those at the bookstore. But <laughs> I know they sell some of the other um, giant microbes. Your turn. Uh. Superman leather jacket. It won't let us do it because we're on stream. Right. Cool. Remember <laughs> when I just started typing stuff? Mm-hmm. I mean, I wasn't sure. I- I'm glad we tried, though. No. If you never try, you never know, and then you feel better about yourself. <laughs> Superman. What was weird is when I typed in Superman before, it was like Superman shirts for men. And I was like, why would you ever have to specify? Well, because you could have, like, super... I've seen girls' Superman shirts that are, like, really low-cut, specifically for boobs and stuff. But you would see that. Like, when you searched it on Amazon, you'd be able to look at that and be like, I can't wear that, right? Well, what if it's, like, two t-shirts that look very similar, but when you buy it... Or maybe it's the exact same t-shirt, but when you buy it, one is in men's sizes and one is in women's sizes. So you're like, oh, I need this size as a man... But you choose that in a woman's size, and it's not the right fit. When you buy like shirts, do you go by like number sizes, or do you just see if it's like small, medium, or large? Yeah. yeah. So I think are women. I could have sworn women shirts were not like that. Yo, Papa G, don't they have numbers? I mean, I've heard of like a woman's small before. You're right. I I honestly don't know. Like I'm more or less asking. As if you would. <laughs> mm. From all the women's clothing I'd buy, I have to say. <laughs> so I am interested in possibly getting a Superman leather jacket. But do you want that one? That one's kind of ass. I like that one because it's not super, like, in the sense that this one, you know it's Superman. It can't be anything but Superman. This one, like, you'd have to get right up on you and then be like, oh, it's Superman. That's kind of why it's ass. If I'm buying a Superman, like the first thing is Superman, Superman black leather jacket but for imagine, $75. But imagine you're like, I'm going to go to a Marvel convention, but all I have <laughs> is my Superman black leather jacket. Then you're like the coolest person there because you fuck with the DC. Like, I, 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 Or people hate you. Or people start a, start a, a mob to kill you. A mob to kill you. You can't kill better comics. Marvel's been trying for years. Damn. Um, I actually would really like the black leather jacket one if it had... <laughs> can you tell the difference? I can tell the difference. Can they? <laughs> Papa G said, uh, you can get Logan's jacket on there as well. The Wolverine jacket's very subtle. Because, I mean, it's just the jacket he wears. And then, like, the little X? Does it have a little X? I thought so. I thought it just had, like, the yellow, and I thought it, it was, might. like, brown or whatever. Yeah. yeah. I know some of them have a little X though, like because they're in, they have like uh, they have uniforms, don't they? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Whatever happened, I really wish they would have brought this into the the X Men movies. Um, 
how Wolverine in the comics had like that blue and yellow suit. I wish they would have brought that in. There's supposedly a in credit scene or something for Wolverine. Um, but I think it might have been like one of those deleted scenes where he like opens a case and it shows his suit. But like he never like wears it. It just like it's in this briefcase. No, but I'd love I'd love it to for him to like wear it and for him to have like the weird like like face mask and all that. Yeah, because it's like a big part of like who he is. <laughs> Papa G says it just has the yellow line. Yeah. Oh, okay. Um, if that was like white, like how when uh, Superman dies and he has like the black and like white symbol, mm -hmm. I would really fuck with that. Um, is that like a thing that his suit does? Like when he's dead? Yeah. I don't remember. Or is it just like them changing him into a different outfit, like a funeral outfit? It seems like they just changed him into a different outfit, like a funeral he outfit. Had, he had, like, a Kryptonian funeral outfit, like, brought with him. His parents were like, in case you're an adult and you die. <laughs> <laughs> Hit me up, fam. We've got this pre-made. Um, we know what size you're going to be. Some people complained that... Spoilers for Justice League. Some people complained that when Superman... Um, comes back to life in Justice League mm -hmm. that he should have had like a black and white costume and the way they would have explained it is that like Superman gets his power from sunlight and when Superman died the sunlight in like his suit that had like been stored kind of like dissipates or whatever. So it changes the color of the suit? Yeah and then as he like is in the sunlight more and he absorbs more. It turns yeah, because um, then uh, more spoilers for Justice League. And Justice League, when Superman comes back, at I've, first he's I've like been, evil. I've seen, I've seen it. Well, it's full of spoilers for them. Oh. And also, it's for their context. I understand it. <laughs> he's like evil. And it would also show like the hope and love coming back into Superman as, as he adjusted back. Like the color like shifted to more hopeful colors and stuff. And I get that. But at the same time, in the, in the newest. Um, one, he didn't like he didn't get reincarnated in sunlight. He got reincarnated in that like nuclear waste shit. Mother box yeah. thing, yeah. Yeah. I said nuclear waste, but it wasn't nuclear waste. It wasn't it was at like, all. <laughs> no, it was like water and a mother box. And and flashlight. So I guess that's similar, but no. <laughs> Let's see. This one I think is doing too much. What do you think? Like, if you or I was wearing it. If I was going to buy one, I like subtlety. I'd go with that one. But for that one, if you're specifically trying to get one, like, if you were going to wear that because you specifically want it to be a Superman thing, I could fuck with it. Mm. Here's another subtle one. I like the little arm ridges or whatever. I like that one, it. too. But I also like that it's subtle like that. That one just straight up looks like the suit. I don't know how I feel about that one. So the one right under it, outfitter jackets yeah. or whatever. So the one that straight up looks like the suit, I kind of fuck with that one um, significantly more than this. This is like Superboy from Young Justice. Right. This is like the current show on TV, Krypton, where they're like on the alien planet kind of thing and nobody has powers because people don't have powers on Krypton. So he just has hoop on a leather jacket? Like what? Well, that's because it's like his house symbol or whatever. Like, they have, like, clans? Yeah, that's, like, a big thing. They're Genghis Khan? They're all the one Genghis Khan? So it's, like, how uh, Superman's real name is, like, Cal L. Right. The L is, like, the last name. So L is Hope, and that's what's on the thing? See, that's the weird thing. Like, each house has, like, their own crest, but your crest can also have its own meaning. So the word for Hope is also the crest for the house of L. But it's not L. <laughs> I thought you were about to say, but it's not L, it's S. And I was going to be like, damn. Um, Papa G said, get a Winter Soldier jacket, uh, but I just like the all-black Superman one. I do, off of, like, the Superman, thank you, I agree. Off of the Superman, like, design, I like blue leather jackets. Like, I think that one looks cool, just without the Superman S on it. Like, it having the Superman S on it, I feel like I'd want it to be black. Hmm. Just because I like red, like as far as color schemes go, I like with red and black over blue and red. Also, a hundred and fifty dollars. It got me fucked up. 
it it looks nice. It reminds me of what like Metropolis Kid, which was like Superboy in the nineties, would wear. Mm-hmm. And I kind of fuck with that. Well, and also it's probably like an actual leather jacket. I mean. Yeah. Well, I would hope these other ones were also actual leather jackets. Not necessarily, because that one's like costume color. So you have Ooh. to check. Yeah. See. It goes all the way up to one forty-five. So maybe if it's one forty-five, maybe. That's <laughs> That would suck if it wasn't. Yeah. They're just like, we just charge a lot for Superman stuff. When I was younger, that I saw cool. this one, the all red one. one. I kind of fucked with it, but I don't know. I still think it's too subtle. I would prefer black if it was going to go subtle. And even then, where's the fucking white S? Just put the white S on the black thing, and I think it, it pops. It goes well. I can get that. I, but if they did the white ass on it, I'd also want to see like the arms like have white stripes or something like that something to keep it. the theme going. Yeah, yeah, not just like a white ass. Mm-hmm. Papa G said the first all black Superman jacket on top of the list is nice. Agree. Um, I like the red. I like the red one because I guess that is like what Superman has worn before or whatever. I think that before. one's not even a Superman jacket. Oh, it's not. It's like well, in no, Smallville, but it's small. right? He yeah, like wears the jacket. it's just like I'm Clark Kent and I'm wearing a jacket. Like I don't think right. it even has the symbol. But that's the thing. Like I, I don't wear blue shirts enough for that. I, I, I wear, I wear, I'd wear red on red, and it'd be weird. It wouldn't be that weird. <laughs> I don't want to. I don't want to pop for it wouldn't work. Also, I wouldn't pay one hundred thirty dollars for it. Mm. Ooh, I mean these prices are steep. Yeah. Star Lord Galaxy Super Jacket for man. Right. That's not Star Lord. Star Lord is is Hope Star Lord. <laughs> is Hope Cal Star Lord? I see where they're going with it because they're like, Star Lord is the superhero who wears leather jackets. See though, yeah. this fucks with me. Biker faux maroon leather jacket. A hundred forty dollars. Oh, that is a lot for right? not real. Leather. So that's what I'm saying. I don't know how legit all these are. They may just lie. That one's interesting. Tom Welling. Oh, that one is cool. I like how it like blends together though. Mm-hmm. And it has like the red and black, but not like this. I don't like that one. Yeah, it's so weird how like they're so close, but this one seems to fuck up. Right. Well, because that one, it also looks like it would fit your body like more specifically. And that one just sort of looks like it drapes. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Uh, in order for them to know what we're talking... Because they can't really... S- they can see us, but not necessarily like where we're pointing. Okay, this one, that one... They still can't see that. Oh. Yeah, like that the Tom Welling one uh, seems cooler than the F and H, even though they're really similar. <laughs> if you want to follow along. Um, that's weird. Yeah. Yeah. That S doesn't seem like it's in the right place. It looks like they went for, like, exact middle, mm-hmm. and I feel like it's not. Yeah. That one's not even Superman. Neither I, is that. I think at this point they're just like, leather jacket. Yeah, you just want a leather jacket. Okay. Uh, that was my turn on that one. Okay. I got you. We're sorry, but we couldn't find any matches. Can I research? Yeah. Okay. You can do some research. I'm gonna try my best. Um Go on about here shooting threes. You can man. Let's see. Looking up uh gay on Amazon. <laughs> Papa G said the Punisher leather trench coat. How do I? How do I do? You gotta just hit the magnifying glass. Oh, you already searched gay. Oil for gay men. Attract men. What? What? Yep. That's the first thing that comes up when you type in gay on Amazon. Yep. Is a pheromone oil to attract men? Yep. It just. It makes people gay. Confirmed. <laughs> <laughs> Pheromones. It makes you gay. <laughs> you gotta make sure to throw that product placement in. Pheromones. <laughs> it makes you gay. It's called Ferex. Pheromone oil. What? Yeah. What if it just smells like body odor? I imagine that's what it is. Mm-hmm. Like, they're like, uh, so we're gonna hire you to just do Sweat the treadmill the all day. Yeah. Wait, but then why, w- why wouldn't you just want to be sweaty? Why would you be like, I'm gonna put other people's sweat on me? 
So here's a. Uh, it's like attractive people's sweat. <laughs> LGBT 100 feet rainbow flag. 100 feet. But that's a lot of different. That's not one. That's not one rainbow flag. That's like 87. <laughs> it's only twelve dollars for 100 feet. I don't fuck. I don't fuck with it. You don't. Gotta be it. one big one. Um, Marlon Bundo. What? Oh, that's oh, that's the yeah, thing that's the John I, Oliver. Book. Yeah, that's Kindle cool. edition, only eight fifty one. I'm a porn star, gay for pay. Gay for pay, that sounds like a prostitute. Well, porn stars also are gay for pay. You don't have to be a prostitute to well, be a porn star. I think star. I think that's what they're saying. Yeah. This book is gay, is it? The book like has sex with just other male books. Only male books. But well, like, I don't know. Well, how do they define a male book? A male book. How is it like a book about men, or is it like a book that has the like? Is a bookmark a penis? Because like, can a Mary Poppins book be a male book? Okay. If it has a bookmark. But if it doesn't, it doesn't. then no. But you can remove an ad sex in a change. book. Sex <laughs> change. You had it. You had it. So now. So you just glue in a book. <laughs> <laughs> Call me by your name. And Wait, but every time you turn a page and you're like, I gotta move the book part, you're like changing their sex like millions of times throughout their life? Yeah. No. Natural <laughs> course of being a book. White House. And now, this isn't even. This isn't even. I well, think. White House. Hello, everyone. Welcome back, or welcome to another exciting live stream. It's your host, your friend, your boy, Jeff Blythe, one only here with. Monetization. Demonetization. <laughs> And today, we are looking at cool stuff on Amazon. Uh, if you saw our last video, Winslow searched uh, gay on Amazon, and we're checking out what comes up. Yep, it's a lot of books. Yep, it is a lot of books. I'm disappointed. This book is free if you have what? Kindle Unlimited. My thing is, it went from like 100 to zero. It went from hormones that attract men to... Yeah, the books. Yeah, like the <laughs> most sensational thing is the first result. That actually makes a lot of sense. Yeah, yeah. I guess because it piques your interest. The so Superman leather jackets were like that to an extent. Like no, once you get the toward first the one was the black one. Well, I agree. The first one wasn't the coolest one, but yeah. near once you like scroll past a certain amount, it's just leather jackets. Like it has nothing to do with Superman anymore. So this, this one just had like not as much good. And this one, it, it doesn't even say books, though. It just says gay, gay. and then they're like books. Yeah, they're like, w Amazon is a host to many gay books. And I'm like, but I just, there's... No the premier service for homosexual books. Okay. Our books are, are without borders on gender. We have all sorts of books. Okay. Gender has nothing to do with sexuality. About Us, it's another book. Wish Upon the Stars. Upon. God and the Gay Christian, Confessions, Robbie. Did he confess he was gay? I wonder. I wonder. <laughs> God and the Gay Christian, all about Robbie. <laughs> College boys live live. Live? Yeah. Are they gay? I think it. I think it's like porn. Uh, oh. Watch for zero dollars with a Prime membership. Yeah. Only so two stars porn. doesn't seem like it's a very good porn. It's not. It's just actual like people just. Going to class. And it's like, just this. College, <laughs> college boys <laughs> live. <laughs> Promises it's a, part four. It's, you hunters. see that it was uploaded like 30 minutes ago. <laughs> Pray the gay away? Stop. Did I click it? I did. <laughs> <laughs> That's just going to pop up in your uh, in your like Amazon wish list now. Like, Do you want to try for free? No thanks. Oh, I think it's. I like think this is a joke. parody. Yeah. yeah, I'm glad. I thought I thought it was like no serious. Yeah, yeah, I was you really gotta... like no. Chronicles of Spartak, Rising Sun. So that just sounds like a cool young adult novel, but he's gonna be gay. Right. Yeah, they're not wrong with that. That's, it's, that's it's a cool um, title. It no, it's literally Percy Jackson, but he's, he's gay. gay. <laughs> <laughs> Hey guys, um, I noticed that the world has become uh, a lot more open to like really cool ideas. So I got like a few movie pitches for you if that's totally okay. It's the same <laughs> thing as everything. But, but he's, he's gay. gay. <laughs> yes. 
Um, so I noticed that Black Panther really broke uh, like superhero movies, like for box office. Right? So, so Marvel, I got, I got a pitch for you. Uh, his name is Sports. Negro Pussy. <laughs> he's Black Panther, but he's gay. <laughs> Go, Ilsa, Ilsa, we got him. <laughs> no one's ready. <laughs> From Let's the people see. who brought you Sparta. <laughs> Let's see. Now it's Jet's turn. What would I want to buy? Let's see. Dinosaur jeans. Damn. But not like Jurassic Park. Like, no. I want some pants with some dinosaurs. No, for like an adult, please. They're like, <laughs> no adult would buy <laughs> jeans with a dinosaur on them. He's like, no, they don't make shit. them for us. No, they don't. Ah. <laughs> They're like, adults don't like dead things. What the fuck? I wouldn't have minded having jeans with dinosaurs on them. If I typed in unicorn jeans, I almost dare guarantee there are like adult unicorn jeans. Real dead body. Well, I'm on a list. <laughs> <laughs> 446 results. Oh, I'm so fucking sad. A natural loofah. I thought it said chocolate boy scrub at first, and I was like, interesting. Chocolate body scrub, 100% natural. Firm skin anti aging Why does it need a handle? Because you have you a, you're scrubbing it, like, yourself. Right? It's for just you. With the bag, you just like fucking not with the bag. But the that's what the comes bag. in the bag, right? No, that's like attached to the side. We of the bag. we gotta look at this. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's just like an attachment on the bag. Yo, where are my images at? Look what at that shit? It's just a handle on the back. That's not useful. It's not. They're thinking you're gonna like, okay. <laughs> <laughs> like, people love this stuff. People if you don't look at the handle, it looks like a big ass condom. And they were like, we don't want it to look like a giant condom. What does it need? A handle. <laughs> <laughs> Condoms don't have handles. What if we just change the material? No. <laughs> what if we just added, like, more imagery to the design? Never. <laughs> Brand recognition. We gotta be the one that looks like a condom mug. <laughs> Your fresh condom coffee by Deluge. Deluges. <laughs> I, I am Deluges. I am Lucius. Are you supposed to eat it? I think it. <laughs> I think it's like they're trying to tempt you. Like, don't. But it's good. Is that? Do some people get like a thrill off of that? Like, try our new soap. It tastes exactly like can That was Tide Pops. That was the whole meat. We're behind them, bro. We're behind. Now companies like, are months. like jumping onto it. They're like, we know the kids. <laughs> <laughs> you thought detergent was delicious? Try body scrub made from all natural chocolate. No, that's how people secretly get away with doing bath salts. What if this was bath salts? It is bath salts. <laughs> <laughs> it's chocolate bath salts. We just someone read the description. Someone marketed it with a handle because you're like. <laughs> <laughs> I kind of wanted to see if there were like reviews, and they're like, it's just chocolate bath salts. It's just chocolate in a bag. <laughs> what is the consistency of this? What is, is the package true? of a handle? <laughs> <laughs> Our new package has a patent design. It's innovative and very convenient to grab. It's not innovative. <laughs> <laughs> I like that it is in like the frequently asked questions. My whole thing. You can't just do stupid shit to something and be like, it's innovative. The consistency is like paste. Someone's like, is it like dry coffee grounds? And they're like, no, it's like a paste. Did you think you were just going to rub powder on your body? <laughs> well, but that's even weirder, though. To like open up a bag and to just shove your hand into like a paste. It with doesn't a have a nozzle. That's what I'm saying. Like with a handle. They, like they could have put a nozzle on it, but they're like, no. We need to use the extra plastic for a handle. It's like one of those weird resealable plastic bag bitches. But with a hand. That's, that's, excuse me, rather gross. It is. Ooh. 
And they're like, we know marketing. We got this. Marketing. I'm glad I looked this up. Anime High School of the Dead hugs pillow case pillow cover okay, manga so cosplay. Okay, body pillow. Okay. I like that they put the little Ghostbuster, like, no symbols. Over, over like, yeah. yeah. They're like, trust, there are tits and vaginas on this pillow. If you, you can't turn your body symbols. like that. You can't, you can't turn your body where you're like, here are my tits and my pussy. <laughs> That's not how that works. Is that real? Am I like overestimating the pose? I think so. Well, because that yeah, that's she like is the lying. Back leg. So Wait, she's like lifting on. up her back leg and then like turning like that. Yeah, it's possible. Actually, I just realized she's not even really turned. Yeah. Because if you look at her legs, it's just this. But she's lying down. No one can see me. <laughs> like no, see? you're right. You're right. Yeah, like that's actually a perfectly normal pose. The way that her butt is just to the side like makes it look it like, like she's, she's like turning. turning around. But there's no turning involved. Kuroki real for lazy play dead rabbits plus doll. Oh shit, so they killed a rabbit and made the fur into a rabbit? No. It's well, real fur. It is real fur. So they killed a rabbit and then made a stuffed rabbit out of the rabbit that doesn't look like a real rabbit? That doesn't sound right. It seems like it's a knockoff of, like, for real friends. Oh, maybe it's not them. It looks like actual rabbit fur. Like, it looks Does like it really, real though? Rabbit. A little bit. I don't think it is. You don't think it is? Material. Rabbit yeah. fur. Super cute and soft. Play dead rabbit. All the caps. Ideal companion for your keys, bag, cell phones, car. Very genuine fur and realistic figure. All... Look like a real rat. No, it doesn't. It does. It does not <laughs> look like a rabbit. But blurred eyes, drooping long ears, lazy and relaxed legs and feet. It's, it's like, like a, a naughty, naughty adorable, adorable bunny who loves playing dead and fool you. It's like a naughty bun. The <laughs> naughty was very like weird. It like, felt suggestive. Yeah, like you're like, supposed to fuck your keychain. Your keychain made of actual dead rabbit fur. Really strange. It's just playing. It's, it's what it likes it like you're supposed to like lie to your friends like no this is my this is my pet rabbit he it was like he's he's dead you hung him on a purse it's like no no, no. he's he's so naughty <laughs> he's so naughty uh, <laughs> no i imagine that's for like little kids because then it's like yeah well because it's like oh this is my pet rabbit i'm bringing it to school that's not a real rabbit. Yeah, Test it its is. fur. <laughs> Jimmy, Jimmy like cuts the fur with like little play scissors. He, he tries, them. but it's like the scissors that like can barely even cut fucking paper. They're like safety scissors, and he's like, I, I can't. <laughs> no, that'd be amazing if he like um, if they're like, how come your rabbit never blinks? And she's like, shut up. <laughs> he's, I've never beat it at a staring contest. Never. Gifted. They, <laughs> he like they test it and they like stab it with a pair of scissors and like there's an actual dead rabbit inside there and they just <laughs> stab into the rabbit and they're all like there's a prize inside and there's one kid running around the playground like it's just like the cereal boxes it's just <laughs> <laughs> with like a rabbit heart <laughs> jeez my little corpses my little corpses hang them on a bag. Pretend they're sleeping. <laughs> <laughs> Halloween decoration shadow curtain set by Ambison Zombies Dead Men Body. Zombies <laughs> Dead Men Body. Um, Halloween toy tongue gross jokes prank magic Halloween horrific prop. I feel like that's hard plastic. Oh no, it's not. You can stretch it. It's rubber. Yeah. I was gonna be say that would suck if it was just a hard plastic thing. Lava pumice stone. This isn't even, this is getting into dead skin. This isn't even fighting. You typed in real dead body. And that's not what it gave me at all. <laughs> <laughs> Makari 24K gold lightning soap. Does it really have gold in it? This is when I say no, and then it says made of real rabbit fur. <laughs> not for $30, right? Maybe like flakes. Maybe it's like the easiest way to get real gold. <laughs> Buy a shit ton of soap. Uh, the gold standard for beauty. Uh, 20, is it, 
It's the name of their collection. Okay. Hold on. Let's just see. Do they have... Where's the part Ooh, where it's watch like, the gold fleck slowly flake away. So maybe it does. I don't know. That's not convincing enough. Over eight product lines. I feel like I've seen this fucking image it ha- of yeah. her. It's like a some, shit. It, yeah. It's like a stock photo. Mm-hmm. Like that has nothing to do with your brand. Bernie said, hey, uh, where's Winslow? Hey, where's I'm Winslow? old here. Gold flakes. <laughs> so, gold, licorice, mulberry root, omega 3s, and probiotics. I now know how to make your soap. Ha! You shouldn't have given me all the ingredients. Now I just need to go buy some gold flakes. <laughs> I went to a school called Mulberry. Oh. Uh, I'll make sure to name the cartoon I make after your life, uh, Mulberry. Are you making? Are you making a? The cartoon about me? Bernie, get on that cartoon as soon as possible. Call it Mulberry. Love to see it. Bernie then makes a Boondocks reference. Uh, that name slip back. Slip, slip, slip back. That's what it is. <laughs> Money drawing spell kit for cash, prosperity, success, financial security, and abundance. And also, dead body. Like, I wonder what about real dead body links to money drawing magic spell. Maybe it's made by a dead guy. <laughs> Maybe it's made of dead people. Soylent Green Money Drawing <laughs> Spell Kit. Uh, we're just looking at cool stuff on Amazon. Or, I guess, weird stuff on Amazon. It's whatever you want. It's turned into weird stuff. Short sleeve nightshirt sleep shirt for women. Damn. Real dead body are the tags <laughs> for this. <laughs> Damn, bro. Love and Attraction Spell Kit for Romance <laughs> Compassion. Yeah. What the fuck? Is it the same seller? It looks like the same shit. Yeah, Art Wait, of the Root. What the next one? Premium exfoliating bath go- bath gloves for boxing uh, your shower demons. The a- case of the broken doll. An Inspector David Graham cozy mystery book number four. When you just skip over the bath salts. I mean, they didn't say eat it with a handle. <laughs> <laughs> The, the handle's how you know it's really bath salt. Killed box set. I've Golden never heard of killed. Bands. Look at how many DVDs are that. There's, and you've never heard of it. It's actually like a 46 season <laughs> thing. They're like, we've been on for so long in in the Ukraine. And <laughs> it's zero dollars for Kindle Unlimited. You can probably watch all of killed if you have Kindle Unlimited. Kindle Unlimited gives me a box set of DVDs. No, I'm sure it's like, well, I'm sure it's like a like a Netflix type service, like where you can watch the things that are uploaded. That's Amazon Prime. And Kindle, Kindle? for books. <laughs> Winslow. <laughs> Horror in the Highlands. Um, I guess that's it. You guys, oh, you right. How'd you know? How'd you know we were at the bottom? I saw the little thing. (laughs) It cheated. Let's see. So, oh, you've never seen uh, Coat Lyoko before? I have not. I've heard of it. Like, the name sounds familiar, but if you ask me what it was about, I would say, oh, it's all about Lyoko coats. So we're going to see if they have a Kolioko. Yes. Warning. <laughs> when the warning is just not specific, people are like, what does that mean? Trigger one. <laughs> so I'm going to see if they have any Kolioko body pillows. They couldn't match the search. Nope. Just a regular pillow. Actually, yeah. yeah and then you, just generic body pillows. When you said Kolioko, it immediately reminded me of... Oh, it's your turn again. Okay, I'm trying to think of what it's called. Um, you remember the show on Cartoon Network that was about like the girls who were spies? Totally spies. Yeah, that's what I thought of it. Produced by Marathon. Marathon also produced Martin Mystery, uh, Amazing Spies, which takes place in the same universe as Totally Spies. That but sucks. it's a mix of like boys and girls, and they're different that ages. Sucks. That really sucks. Um, they also made Monster Buster Club, which was on JetX, and that was like a CGI show. When I was a kid, I was like, I, I liked the girl from Totally Spies. I was like, oh, damn. Right. Do you mean, like, Wood Smash, 2005, 
Yeah, <laughs> you already know. I mean, I guess, but I wasn't like like that at that point. I don't know. I wasn't like my first thought was like, oh damn, that was a fuck. <laughs> um, um, who was the hottest member of Totally Spies? On three, say either like their hair color or their name. One, two, three, the probably one Sam. One. Sam's the redhead one. The red one. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> if it's not, for me, it's the redhead one or the black hair one. I, I like, didn't fuck with the blonde. I like the blonde. She was, uh, yeah, as my mom would say, high maintenance. Yeah. <laughs> do high maintenance. Um, trying to think of a good one. Don't forget to post in the live chat uh, cool stuff that you find on Amazon or where you'd like us to search on Amazon. Y- yummy. Yummy butt. Don't don't pull up butter. If it pulls up butter, you can just take your turn because I'm going to be disappointed. Yummy mitt. Oh, it's a teething mitten for it's babies. Like I am on a list. This what do you think was going to happen? I thought it was oh, going to Workout Session. legging with mesh. Ooh, I know what I'm gonna look Your birth butt tub. Get Ew. a great bum. No need to squat. Why is that the name? <laughs> like, what if that was the actual whole name? Like, you gotta <laughs> read the whole thing. Yeah. I mean, there's a lot of text on that bottle. Like, yeah. do you think if we, like, zoom in on that picture? No need to. Yummy mummy post pregnancy care delightful derriere. For a form and fashionable bum. I, I just bum to, to have muscles. like that scream. No need to squat. <laughs> I would love it to say no need to squat. Um, I, I really don't care for this one. I, you can go ahead. You can go ahead. That was pretty good. That one. Yeah. Um. Oh shit. Yeah. Do you think there's such a thing as like penis shrinking pills? And do you <laughs> yes. <laughs> and do you think you can find them on Amazon? Probably not. So I'm gonna. I'm sure there's some dude out there who's like, "Fucking, can never have sex, dude. Every time I do, I just literally kill the person." <laughs> <laughs> so many whores by the shore, man. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm gonna search. Either that or it's someone who's like. Who's like lover is really into little dick, and they're like, I just need. <laughs> <laughs> if only. So shrinking pills, yo, Kirby, welcome to the stream. Is gonna have you. Shrinking pills automatically brings up like weight loss. Then this one, if you ever wanted to see a surgical picture of a vagina on a, like a box for a product. Oh, but so it's. Oh, it's like, a book. It's it's to like. Natural way of shrinking fibroid. I gotta actually do, bro, watch your eyes. That doesn't make sense. Brace yourself. It's going to be a big... Look at your eyes in your eyes. We'll tell you when it's safe. Now it's safe. (laughs) So is this for, like, making the pussy tight? I think. (laughs) (laughs) Discover common leaves you can juice together. Why would you pay $10 for that? Why wouldn't you just look that up on the internet at that point? They're common leaves. (laughs) <laughs> it's not like you're gonna find like a rare leaf. That's for cardio training. But for Fibroid $2. muscle miracle cure. How I proved my doctors wrong and shrunk fibroids. That's not Is this like a common thing? I feel like it definitely has to do with the vagina. No, fibroid? What? Dude, look at okay, look at this picture where it shows like a vagina. That's true. Okay. And Maybe then look so. at this picture where she's like, oh, my vagina. Oh, <laughs> like the first sick. picture is like just a, is glowing vagina. Kaioken vagina. Okay. Okay. Let's see. Pure Calorum natural extract, weight loss, camo. They can't see your fat. fucking <laughs> uh, Let's see. <laughs> they can't see your fat. Bra, blah, blah, this bra, should be John blah, Cena's blah, blah. Like, new intro. We can't see <laughs> them. <my> fat. <laughs> All you gotta do is jump in a ring. As the camera adds 10 pounds, your shirt removes the rest. <laughs> you only look 10 at the end. Uh, yeah, Aiden. It's okay. your turn. Yeah. Gosh, you 
SSX toys? You're just gonna look up sex toys. Yeah. Cool. More lists. More lists. I didn't even go to okay, Incognito. Incognito would have made a lot of sense for this stream. Yep. <laughs> sex furniture. I want to see what kind of furniture. Yeah, there's the sex swing. One of my friends, uh, in their parents' closet, they found their parents' sex swing. Um, maybe they should stop looking in their parents' closet. <laughs> <laughs> it's one of those things where if you were like, hey, mom and dad, I found your sex swing. It's like, well, you had to look for it. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't put that shit in the living room. I don't know why. Why were you in my closet? <laughs> Hanging on door bondage sex swing. A swing though just doesn't sound like it just sounds like more work. Like I don't. Is it more or less work? Well, but it, it's like on a like imagine if you specifically like if it was the opposite thing, where like you had to tie up like parts of your legs and hang in midair and like constantly be flexing your muscles to sit upright to have sex with. Now, what if I just don't sit upright? Then you just fall down. <laughs> and you're like hanging upside down, down. on the floor <laughs> with your legs in the air. <laughs> and then they're like, I'm going to bed. <laughs> Sex wedge. It's a. It's just a pillow. They're like, but my pillow is not shaped right for sex. <laughs> it's, it's an incorrectly shaped pillow. That pillow's inefficient for my sexual relations. <laughs> I guess for, like, positioning? I don't know. Another swing. I don't know why. Sex baby adult sex swing bondage with steel triangle frame fetish restraint. And it has a whole bunch of different positions. The images on the side fuck with me. They're like, look at how you can do this. Like, in case you lack the imagination, <laughs> here are the different positions that you can do. Kinkly. It's so that she can sit on your face. Thanks, Dad. Thank the message <laughs> from Dad is pretty great. <laughs> um, but I like that it's for her to sit on your face. Or, I guess not specifically. True. Because the, the description. It can be anywhere. Yeah. She It's for her to sit anywhere. <laughs> it's like, I just bought this because it's comfortable. I, don't know. <laughs> I guess. Would that be better for anything? I guess you'd have it. We need a girl on the show for this. Hey guys, welcome to Jet Winslow and uh, Naya. Today we're going <laughs> <laughs> Tears. Sexy Samba, doggy style position, support sex, play straps. So it's just like anything. She's like, don't touch me. Just put your dick in me. <laughs> and he's like, but how am I going to have, how am but, I going to firmly grasp it? But like that, that's just the equivalent of getting anything that's like sort of long. Like, why does it have to be that? I think it's made for her comfort. Okay. Like, if you just get something that's long right. enough, she could be like, it's chafing. Right, you're like a material. And then you're thing. like, but it's I'm like using lube. And it's like, not your dick. <laughs> <laughs> it, it has to be like a material thing, I guess. Yeah. 360 spinning sex swing. Jeez. It's evolving. <laughs> They're like, in case you want to get dizzy. 360 4D IMAX experience sex swing. <laughs> Door 360 spinning IMAX 3D experience 4D extra rumble pack. You like you like buy that. smell a vision. You like buy that and set it up, and then they're just like, no, just spin me around in a circle. That's all I want. <laughs> this is, we could just take a carousel ride. It's not the same. Teacups closer. <laughs> There's just another wedge. Yeah. This one is really like low key. The other one was like sex pillow wedge. This one's liberator, 24 inch wedge, black microfiber. And then he's like, what do you think, honey? And she's like, you had me a 24 inch black. It's you like, that's not even an the $80 triangular <laughs> pillow. <laughs> <laughs> oh, they have another one. 
The, okay, the black one is very incognito. And is $80. And then the white one, which is, is 40 <laughs> is like not incognito at all. It's like Wild Night Sex Pillow. But it, Discover insanely great sex and add a spark to your relationship. From a triangle. Though. From a triangle. I, I don't know if that's how that works. Let's compare these reviews. What? They're the exact, because it's the exact same material. That one just has a case on it. More people bought this one. Okay. Even though it's like eighty dollars, I guess because they were like, "Well, if it's more expensive, it's a better triangle pill." <laughs> Maybe also so that if someone was to like see it on your porch and it says like "Liberator twenty four inch," I'm one, sure they no have, one like, knows what discreet shipping. Yeah. That probably cost extra. Well, then again, it the extra shouldn't be where this would be more <laughs> expensive. Yeah, I see what you mean. Adult exercise air pillow, inflatable toy, enjoy relaxing air. Hashtag, oh, oh. pillow for men. What? Pillow for men. That's clearly a girl writing it. You just... That's a girl. Right, but you... Uh, adult exercise air pillow. So it's just exercise? It's like... Not Does that look like exercise? I have no idea. Nothing okay. about that is screaming exercise. I guess they're like, you need to get in shape to like be able to do this maybe, maybe it's like sex exercise okay. like it's exercise to like get you ready get you. it's like don't worry honey last night i did 40 reps on my adult <laughs> exercise air pillow oh adult exercise duh it's adult exercise for like the smash mouth oh i thought it was the 2000s like band. For, for like track soundtrack i thought it was like Workouts that are so intense that you wouldn't trust it to anyone over the age under the age of eighteen. If you're under the age of eighteen, stay away from P ninety plus X. P ninety plus X is only for ninety year olds and up and to get back in shape. It'll actually kill you. <laughs> Jet toys. Why are all these swings? It's just swings. This is specifically like sex furniture. Right, but I would think there's more. They're not very creative with furniture. The swings are like the most creative furniture they have. <laughs> the other ones are triangle pillows. That's not furniture. That's a pillow. And are you ever like look at all these furnitures I have on my bed? <laughs> <laughs> she sleeps with twenty furnitures. <laughs> I don't get it. <laughs> So no, like if you went to like Bed Bath and Beyond or some shit, and you I'd like, like to see you your furniture. furniture, and they bring you to like we have a lovely set of chest of drawers here, and you're like, where the fuck and are the, the pillows? Cytheria <laughs> <laughs> G spot. You go to like Table Emporium, and it's like I like to see your furniture. Cool. All we sell is furniture, <laughs> and it's like you leave, and it's like I didn't see a bit of I didn't see a single <laughs> furniture. <laughs> I'm going to go home and sleep on my furniture. <laughs> Cytheria G-Spot sex magic cushion sex furniture for a couple adult sex that's toys the, items. It's just the pillow. It's just the It's the triangle. Yeah, it's just sideways. Saying. But they like describe it like it's multiple pieces of furniture. But, oh, man. It's they made the it look like it was the bed. Right. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's furniture. Here it is in a box. No, that's not the same thing. That's the same thing that was Weightless like sex stool. That is like the same thing as the other one. Would you like to sit down while having sex? How about on a wedge? Are you crazy? <laughs> well, my history is shit now. Okay, let's see. <laughs> Your history is meme trash. Meme trash for real. Oh, how long until your camera recharges? Let me check. Also, I'm going to see if I can get... Static shock. I know I can get static shock on DVD. What do, what would I want to buy? Like genuinely, like a cool thing. I want to purchase some half. They don't have Exo Life on here. They don't sell it on Amazon. Um, VR is app. Uh, oh, VR headset, VR game, and headset. Cause they're gonna be shitty. Oh, oh, so it's charged whenever you need It's charged? Okay. Do you want to do one more round of this? Sure. Okay. Well, well. Let's see, VR game and headset. So first, you're going to start with like some sponsored stuff that's looking like pretty all right. But as we dig deeper, still kind of all right. Right. Also still kind of all right. 
Come on. Oh man, I hope it's not a you have to click to the next page for it to get shitty. At least one of that looks really weird though. Yeah. It's like do you want something coming out of your ears? <laughs> no? Oh. Too bad. <laughs> <laughs> we Welcome to the future. <laughs> They are getting really interesting in design. That one's literally just a headset for you to put a Your phone, phone in. That's stupid. Forty three dollars. That's so <laughs> stupid. Um, that's how it is at the store. That has a chin strap shit. Oh, it's controllers. Yeah. I thought it was like you put your face in there. Um, I also thought that until you pointed out the controllers. Hmm. Let's see, basic. Here we go. And guide to virtual reality. So not a game. I always like reading the shitty game review whenever they like package something with it. Veer Oasis VR headset? No, it's VR. Stop. <laughs> well, it is V R. I was already at stop with the whole Oasis thing. Have you seen Ready Player One yet? No, have you? Yeah. This is so I liked it. I'd be willing to see it again. Uh, so when does it play? I already saw it. When does it play? Like next. Oh. Wait, no, not next isn't like <laughs> <laughs> after these messages. <laughs> like, like, not like that. Like, I watched it like the day it premiered. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, it was me, Bangzel, and uh, Dozer, and Mr. Hand. Mr. Hand was like, I don't want to see it, it's going to be shit. When is it? And then he like just showed up at the theater. Like, he was there, and we knew he was going to do that. We were like, what the fuck? Was it shit? <laughs> I like it. He yeah. didn't like it. That's what I was going to say. <laughs> um, but they call their thing Oasis. So I was like, mmm, mm, look at this cheap fucking... I wonder if they're going to do it at the at the, the theater here on campus. I think it came out too recently. I mean, sometimes they do like fairly recently. But then like... Normally it's like close to DVD, is it not? I feel like it is. I don't, I don't know. Also, here you are. You are now on the helm for the last cycle of uh, cool stuff on Amy's own. I didn't even find a shitty VR headset. <gasps> Excuse me, to make fun of. Excuse me. Baby coffins. Let's go. Let's go. Hey. Backstage, Backstage baby. baby. Damn it. It's just By music. coffin nails. It's just movie. There goes my baby DVD. I hate this. They don't sell any baby coffins. <laughs> I honestly thought you were going to look up baby drowning stuff. Hey, you could kind of do that. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think that, like, tiny skeleton is big enough for you to put a baby in. Like an infant? Shit. <laughs> You're like, you haven't seen what I've seen. <laughs> Anything's possible. Monster High Dracula doll and jewelry box coffin set. I see why that came up. Yeah, like a fetus? Why does <laughs> baby pull up Monster High? I guess because they're like... My baby loves Monster High. No one's baby understands what Monster High is. But people call their kids baby. No. <laughs> no, I mean, like, that shouldn't be enough for, like, a search term. Yeah. Furnishing eternity. A father, a son, a coffin, and a measure of life. Deep shit? I feel like it's like, my dad and I built this coffin. <laughs> yeah, and it's like we bonded over it. And then he's like, and then we built my son's coffin. Like, the, the author switches her people, and he's like, we also wrote this book together. Then once we finished both the coffins, I shot my son and buried I do and feel then like I shot myself. someone dies. No, I'm sure I'm sure it's like the dad is like terminally ill or whatever. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. that's not what I thought at all. Yeah. I thought it would be like a cute, like almost like... Most fathers and sons build birdhouses, but me and my dad wanted to build a coffin. And then we murdered our neighbor Frank and buried him in the back. <laughs> yeah, not where I was going at. I thought it would be more like a father and a son on hard times, a son who's obsessed with death, 
What could possibly bring them together? Over the course of working together on a coffin, bringing together the father's interest in construction and the son's interest in the afterlife, suddenly the two became inseparable. But then tragedy strikes. Come and visit theaters this spring for Furnishing My Eternity. <laughs> <laughs> my dad died. Like, instead of, like, the really deep sub- subtitle, it's just my dad died. <laughs> and it's just, like, like, they don't even show any of, like, the building. It's just the guy, like, sitting on the chair, like. <laughs> Coffin Baby. The Toolbox Killer is back. DVD. Damn. That's well, close. So, um, I was spending some time with my friend Malachi in Gulf Shores, who's my neighbor upstairs from my parents. Um, and he was telling me uh, this this joke that had happened. It was an event, but he, he's made it into a joke. Uh, he was talking to one of his friends one time, and uh, his friend's grandpa was, like, uh, really tired and was going to sleep, and they were talking outside, so they didn't want to wake him up. Um, so um, Malachi was getting, like, really loud, and his friend goes, like, we gotta like we gotta like keep it down or whatever and malachi like looks at his watch and goes dude it's past midnight your grandpa's dead (laughs) (laughs) and i thought it was hilarious that was very interesting yeah my baby left me i know that is like a song and it's about like the person that like he's currently fucking because i doubt it's actually like that deep it's it's that but Imagine if it was like your child left you, and it's not like a missing child case. It's like he, he just moved on. He, he felt like he didn't need me anymore. <laughs> he <laughs> took his little bottle and he just waddled away. He has a four hundred and one k. He said, <laughs> he said he's done, mom. He has a job now. He's working at fucking Goldman Sachs. And shit. <laughs> <laughs> you put him in a much higher position. I was gonna be like Gerber. But. He's a stockbroker. <laughs> He thought the stock and baby food would go up. He's right. People just keep having babies. It was just a good investment. And then all their babies leave them, so they have more babies. Baby Jack bracelet. Oh, I see. Oh. Oh. Big mouth toys. But that's not even... What? I think it's unrelated to the show. Oh. Yeah. I'm so sad. Big mouth toys is the brand. I thought, like, you put the makeup on, and it, like, makes you... Like, look like the characters. <laughs> coffin Baby. There's another Coffin Baby DVD. Never heard of it until today. Sounds like we'll die from Coffin Baby later on in this horror film. Thank you all for tuning in. <laughs> That's him dying. <laughs> Let's see. Single count custom. There are actually coffin. some coffins. Yeah, it's supposed to be like for Halloween. But you could like put a baby in it. You're right. Goth dad, I love my baby bat. Is that Aww. cringy? Yeah, it is. <laughs> <laughs> Hot topic for dads. <laughs> uh, like, my son totally has no soul. What do you mean? He's ginger. You see these eyes? <laughs> Those are the eyes of my son's first kill. <laughs> I made him shoot this puppy I bought him yesterday. <laughs> then He's I bought him a new me. one. And he said, a dog by any other name is not the same. <laughs> so I backed over to Michael. And he applauded. <laughs> he was like, I hate that dog. Black cats get a bad rap. No. That's definitely a children's story. It's definitely a mixtape. Also by J.G. Piper. J.G. <laughs> Piper is uh, secretly Jay-Z. Uh, Jay-Z, P- <laughs> Jay-Z pipes her. <laughs> Always be piping J.G. Piper. No one ever taught me how to learn. I forgot it, and then I, I just slowly regressed into infancy. <laughs> <laughs> no one ever taught me how to learn. What, End if, of like, <laughs> no, what if, like, he types that sentence, and then every other sentence is him, like, l- like forgetting words, so he just types, like, less and less coherent stuff <laughs> until he's like, help me with it. I could see it being, like, no one ever taught me how to learn. And then, like, as the book continues, it just is all nonsense. Like, it, it only, like, started like that. Or, like, no one ever taught me how to learn, except for these words. 
and then like the rest of the book is he tries to tell a coherent story, but only using the words from those phrases. He's like, uh, no one ever taught me how to learn. Learn no one. <laughs> me taught, taught me. <laughs> learn, learn. Cool. But yeah, thank you all for watching. If you like this video, make sure to like this video. Favorite, comment, subscribe, and ding, ding, ding. Ring that bell so you know if I win every these live streams. It's your host, your friend, your boy, Jeff Black, the one only here with... You can't see my face. Logging out. Peace.